Alrighty. Dr. Disney Chat has finally opened up one of the biggest running stories on the internet. His Trish ban. He still doesn't know the reason why his channel was removed and has confirmed his time on the platform is over for good. Well, at least that might be uh, shocking to hear from him. But Twitch here is is the one responsible for that ban. And if they're doing an investigation, they need to tell us They need to, like, tell us and be honest and be more transparent on why Dr. District Strat has been banned. Because right now, they are not. And about over two weeks later, Dr. District Strat still hasn't gotten a word from them, which is kind of annoying that we have to wait at least maybe two months from now, to hear why Dr. Disrespect, Dr. Disrespect has finally been banned. I mean, Doc was just too much in two months into a brand new exclusive contract with the stream giant and was considered by many to be the face of the platform, which he is. He is the face of the platform. Without without Dr. without Dr. Disrespect, Twitch would be nothing. Nothing but a site that treats tw treats that treats male Twitch Twitch streamers differently from the women streamers, which is still happening. And now, with no answers from Twitch about the reason why, he finally had to break his silence on the situation, claiming it's been a time and of tremendous stress and anxiety for his, for his family. And he said this. It was a total shock. Imagine showing up to work and the doors are closed and you can't get inside. You're going, what's going on? And you've been told you've been fired, but you haven't been told the reason why. He just weren't given an answer. It was the worst feeling. And during the interview, Dr. Disrespect revealed that he had found out about his man while watching another friend stream and sent out an email to Twitch immediately for an update. And, you know, when they put out this statement a while ago, two weeks ago, which says, as it is our process, we take up for reaction when we have evidence that a streamer has acted in violation of our community guidelines or term service. These all apply to streamers regardless of status or prominence in the community. When they say two of these things, the community guidelines and the terms of service, I'm not really sure if the contract had something to do with that. If the contract has something to do with community guidelines or terms of service, then maybe we would know why, but maybe by the, by the next video I make this about the district I'm going to read the 
terms of service and the community guidelines. And I'll probably find anything, if anything has to do with uh, making exclusive contract deals to Twitch, which I don't think it's in any of these two uh, rules right there. But we'll see. And then he did a second interview with PC Gamer, which Disserto reported that the two timer confirmed that his time has certainly come to end. His next big move is in the works, and he seems to have a few options on the table. Well, that's good at least. Then he goes on to say, obviously for legal counsel, I have to be careful here. But I can't say, however, that I will not be turning to Twitch. So, I mean, that's it. Let's just say all the cards are on the table. I'm more focused on making sure whatever we do next. It's a platform move or not. That is, that it's the right decision for the community and champions club that follows me. And that makes sense to what I want to continue to accomplish the, the, this character in terms of taking things to the next level and whether it's streaming outside or stream. So it's just being conscientious of that decision. The report confirmed that in a email doc had confirmed that he's considering streaming on his own website, gemsclub.gg, and other, has other options like YouTube and Facebook gaming as well. Aside from that, it was known that he's considering legal action. Well, despite the fact some believe that it was a legal action, but if it was, then Twitch would be sued. But you know, as I said in my last video, when you talk about things like this, um, when you talk about someone's someone that you just banned, usually you have to give the reason why. they were banned for, and not giving out the reason is just blatantly irresponsible and not being trustworthy. So Twitch, I'm begging you here, if you don't give some crucial details right now, or by the next week, um, you know, you'll be breaking everyone's trust. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Seriously.